Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in return with having when a man is homeless because of a lot of reasons. First, a downturn in the economy. Second, a failure of performance when he's lost somebody important to him. Third, perhaps just the fact that networking and development in business has changed a lot since we've had a plethora or an oversaturation of the marketplace of networking events that really don't produce. When I was making my first attempt at the Business Strategy and Technology Forum, it was a half-day event with about 50 guests in a marvelous space like the Columbia Club or the Athletic Club or something like that. We paid for the space, we hired speakers, and we did a lot of networking, which turned out for many of the people to be pretty good for them. Because I personally wrote letters to businesses, because that was way back before the internet really took hold, and before a lot of the laws interfered with us networking. I find that fascinating how we establish these new technologies that play out over old technology like a telephone line or the airwaves, and yet the way that we are being told to utilize them somehow obliterates the laws that protects our ability to utilize them. But what I'm really talking about today is how important love is today. You see, love for someone is how we feel about them. I might love my birth family, but I'm not in love with them. And I might hate people in my birth family for their behavior choices that harmed my life. But openly, I am not them. I have a right to decide what I'm going to do. And I have the right to decide what I plan to do. And I have the right to decide what I'm going to do with a female stalker or a male stalker that has lied about his rights to be anywhere near my life. And openly, I'm very familiar with license plates today. Typically, I'm very numerically challenged, and I yield to the women that I love more than ever today. There are two of them that are brilliant, they're beautiful, they're blonde, they're tall, they're smart, they're sassy, they're sexy, they're everything a man needs. But what I can say is that the people we love should never fear us. But when we start to abuse, when we start to lie, when we start to manipulate, when we start to steal from other people, we lose our rights to them.